The King Mustangs pitched six innings of shutout baseball against Smithson Valley on Thursday, but it was the lone inning they couldn't keep the Rangers off the bases, the fifth that proved their undoing in a 4-1 loss. Chilling by one entering the fifth, Smithson Valley's Cameron Verstige drove in Gunnar Westerman with a double to left center field to get the scoring started. Then Cody Allen clocked a two-run double to drive in Verstige and Tanner Thompson for the second and third runs of the inning. The Rangers' Walker Romain completed the scoring with a single to left that drove in Allen, rounding out the only four runs Smithson Valley would need. The Tigers picked up their lone run in the third inning when Jonathan Contreras drove in Anthony Handel with a ground out to first, but it was the play that preceded that hit that stirred some controversy. Handel, a speedster, attempted to steal third after having successfully stolen second moments before, but his awkward dive carried him past the plate, and third baseman Chris Adams tapped him on the helmet before he recovered, a play the umpire missed. I kind of thought about sliding head first and went, uh, went, in, went in feet first, obviously. I flipped over and I looked back and I was over the bag, so I just kind of dove back thinking I was going to be out, but I got back in there. Handel later clarified he felt he was safe. For more on the story, pick up Friday's edition of the Corpus Christi Collar Times. This has been Kenny Ryan of the Collar Times reporting.